Meantime, participants at the ongoing WIMBY's conference have been charged to be inspired and live with a desire to take action and do something to change the trajectory of their lives. This was the submission of the executive director of WIMBY's, Hanzatu Adigbite, while speaking at the opening ceremony of the ongoing 2023 conference in Lagos. Plus, the Venice correspondent, Love Ikuku Iyadoku, brings us more in this report. Seated are women from different backgrounds, color, or race. Once again, they have traveled far and wide to listen, learn, unlearn, and relearn, motivate, and inspire one another to activate the seed of greatness in them in order to reach their highest potentials. Veteran broadcast journalist Bimbo Uloyede kick-started the event. She took participants on a journey of how their thought process can activate the seed of greatness inherent in them. If it is true that with God all things are possible, then for you, who are the temple of God, for you, who house the peace of God, for you, who is made in his image, I ask that you speak it as an irrevocable fact that I am possible. And I want to hear it. I am possible. The 22nd edition was an expository, educative, inspiring, and motivational like previous ones. The women were challenged to dare to dream and make it come through. The keynote speaker, Paul Awunibe emphatically encouraged participants to take chances, be resilient, and stay in power. We have done more, at least as much, and probably more than all the men in the world, right? The problem is a narrative. It's taking control of our own destiny and making sure we talk about it and we push it out there and not be afraid. I don't believe in the glass ceiling. As a matter of fact, I think the term should be scrapped. There isn't a ceiling. We've just got to go. We've got to do what we need to do. But you know, it's not tomorrow. It's not when I'm more comfortable. It's not after I have my children. It's not after my children grow up. It's now. The opportunity of a lifetime can only be realized in the lifetime of that opportunity. As the different plenaries, discussants re-echoed the importance of networking, owning their environment, being confident, optimistic, and passionate. As a woman, you have to tell yourself, of course, I'm in need to win it. I'm not just going to be a figure in the, in the, in the male-dominated world. You have to make your stamp known. Like Sherry Sandberg said, uh, don't be afraid to speak up and sit at the table. So don't just be in such sectors. Be there to make a mark. I only come to Nigeria, I think, one year before 2014. That's 2030. Occasionally, I come here to look at the business market. And I found a surprise. Why this country? Everywhere is the used car. So this caused my attention. There must be some business there. That's key in my mind. Then I do the research and I go back. I went back to China. And then when I decide I want to come to invest in Nigeria, so we choose automobile as the industry we enter. Hansatu Adegbite is the executive director of Wimbis. She speaks on the choice of the theme for the 2023 conference. I want you to look at yourself in the mirror as a young girl child and believe that you carry a seed. The thing with seeds is that all it needs is what will activate it to produce fruit. Surround yourselves with the people that will inspire your thought process. Let that seed in you be activated and let your path to greatness be a step at a time, a day at a time, and one day your story will be heard. Highlights of the one of the Wimbits conference included raffle draws, which saw two participants smiling home with three million naira in the Impact Investment Award. The conference continues on Friday. Love Ikuku Uyeduku, Plus TV News. 
Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.